Welcome to Crash Racer. Today we're playing Wreckfest and we're going to have a go at the four daily challenges. Challenge one then is a race at the Vale Fall Circuit. Five lap race, just eight of us in the race. Reasonable start then. So we'll come around these two left handers. Oh, the inside. Can we get up the inside? Yep. Yeah. Oh, not quite. Almost got into the lead. Don't push me wide. Oh, nearly went over the bank. Quite a quite steep banks on the edge of the uh, on the edge of the track on this circuit. So you've got to watch as well, not to get your wheels on the on the certainly on the inside of the corners. Out, you're probably going to end up flipping over. That's the end of uh, the first lap. Pretty much the whole group still uh, still all together. That's good. Managed to sneak through the middle of those two spinners. Ooh, second place has gone a bit sideways, can we get up? Thought I could get past, but no, that's can we undercut. Yeah, there we go. Gets us into second. Ooh. Been a really good race so far, really tight. Quite well matched with the uh, the AI cars. All right, this tight left hand hairpin. Kind of a little bit wide, but that's okay. Two laps left then, and I've pulled a little bit of a gap now. See if we can hold that. that a bit wide looks on the map that we've probably just got one chasing car really as we come round to start the the last lap back marker yeah there's the one chasing car back marker just in sight Hopefully they're not going to uh, get in the way. Yeah, I've got a little bit of a gap on that. Oh, where's he going? Got a little gap on that second place, but not much. Just one mistake and he'll be right on top of me. Got this closed up. Okay, help him bend again. Let's try and keep it tight. Oh, what's that one? There we go, through for a first gold trophy of the day. Challenge two then is a time trial at the Midwest Motor Centre. We're in the lawn mower. Okay, I think it's just a one shot lap then by the look of it. One minute 30 we've got for the bronze trophy. Don't know as yet, obviously, what the silver and gold times are. Let's see how we get on. Don't know if I'm just going to get like a one shot lap or if after the first lap then you can carry on with as many laps as, as you want. Oh, penalties. Seems quite. It's come out. Yeah, penalty again. Cool. This is really uh, harsh on the penalties. This. Only just getting my wheels over, and now I've lost control as well. That's the thing with this vehicle. It's very hard to control. And we come. I mean, that's the last corner. So. Have we done? The, 
we're way under. We've got a goal trophy straight away. It wasn't even a particularly good lap and we got loads of penalties, but I mean, we've done it straight away. That that was a really easy challenge. I mean, it is hard to control those lawn mowers, but... Goal trophy then. Challenge three then is a score streak at the Fairfield Mud Pit. Four minutes, which is a good amount of time, and 2,400 for the bronze trophy, which again is not a, m a massive target. So, I mean, this isn't the worst uh, arena to do score streaks on, but it's it's not the best either. It's it's fairly large and expansive so you can as I'm just demonstrating find yourself driving around aimlessly for a while trying to find someone to hit hopefully we can uh, we can do well though reasonable start so far we hit something quick there we go Yeah, I'm wondering if I'm going to have to, uh, oh, I was going to say, if I'm going to have to keep resetting, yeah, there we go. Yeah, I might reset quite a bit. It's uh, quite often helpful for this type of challenge. Oh, there we go, there's that score multiplier gone that we'd done quite well, actually, to build up. Oh, and that didn't count as a hit either. I don't know why it is that it seems that if you're flying through the air and you hit someone, very rare it actually counts as a hit for some reason. Still only just over halfway towards the bronze trophy. Dearly I want to get that within two minutes because then with any hope the, uh, the silver and gold uh, targets won't be quite as high and also there's, there'll, by that time there'll be quite a lot of damaged cars around. So yeah, I normally find if on these uh, score streaks, if you can get the bonds within about half of your time, then you've got a good chance of getting the silver and gold. Struggling a little bit here though. Let's hit something. There we go. There's the bonds right on two minutes as well. So maybe we've got a chance. Come on, hit something quick. There we go. about another thousand for the or less than that now for the silver lots of damaged vehicles around which is excellent news that's a no oh, that was already uh, wrecked there's a silver though and we only need just under one and a half thousand for the gold as well we've still got one minute 25 left so despite the fact I've just lost all my multiplier again hopefully we can do this Ah, come back. <laughs> I was trying to wreck that. Oh, I think we did manage to wreck it by him reversing into me in the end. One minute left then. Last 30 seconds then, let's just see how many more points we can get. That'll be uh, 3 out of 3 gold trophies for the day so far. Which gives us a chance to go for a, a clean sweep in the last challenge of the day. Last few seconds then. There we go. Just time for that last big hit. 8,522 in a gold trophy.
Fourth and final challenge of the day then and we're at the Fire Rock Raceway, we're in the snow again. Three lap race, all 24 vehicles, I think it's quite nice how they're still doing some uh, some snow challenges at the moment, it makes a nice, uh, a nice bit of variety really for the races. Let's see if we can shove up the inside here. Certainly, oh, and he goes, we'll, we'll help him round on his way. Yeah, snow. Snow's quite good as well, I think. Oh, that was nice, got through that gap there. I think the snow works quite well on the tracks as well. It uh, it makes the grip under acceleration difficult. Obviously, the the handling and grip on the cornering as well. You're sliding round up more. This is quite nice, actually. We can sort of drift around the corners, basically, due to the lack of grip up into second place then, so a good start, Whoop, here comes someone trying to get back at me yeah a little, little bit hard to control as you'd expect especially when you're accelerating all of a sudden you can get a bit of a bit of a twitch on the car up into first taking that a little bit fast just about stopped it in time through the tyres Right, is this the start finish straight? I think so. Yeah, there we go. Start of the second lap. Get back into the lead again. Ah. Car coming up the inside. I tried to tried to let him come past me and then cut back underneath him but I just caught his back end and I'm back up into first now. Oh, car off to the left, watch him coming back on. Gone a bit wide as I'm sure everyone else has. This is a really fun race and a good challenge. You can see there's a whole host of cars right behind me still. Oh. Yeah, a bit slow drifting into that corner. Let that guy get back in front. He's gone a bit sideways or so, so I've got a faster exit. Kind of get around the outside. Ooh, again, a little bit wide on this corner. That's the second time I've done that. Okay, looks like we might be back in the lead then as we come across the line for the final lap. This is going to be a real battle all the way to the all the way to the finish by the looks of it. Struggling for grip here as I'm accelerating. Keep this tidy around this corner. Yeah, still a group of cars fairly close behind. Right, tight hairpin. I'll take this quite tight if I can this time. Not too bad. Oh, one up the inside though. Left a little gap and through he comes. Should be able to hold him off as we come round this right hand though. Ah no! Oh no no! Come on spin, spin, spin! Ah no! Spin on that corner. I thought I was going to be able to keep it spinning, do a full 360 and get going again but oh that's not good right back in 10th now and we're right near the end of the race going to be able to pick up a few places one two three that's all the leaders not, not going to be close enough not going to be enough time for me to get back into the lead that was a great race as well we're going to nick that yeah managed to nick third place and a silver trophy great race though Well that's the end of the challenges for today, three gold trophies and one silver trophy and really, really good fun challenges. I hope you've enjoyed watching the video and see you soon.